can you is there anything that you'd want to say to aspiring traders who are either struggling or still on the journey is there anything like words of wisdom from your experience getting through it um that you think would be helpful uh yeah sure i mean <clears throat> people constantly talk uh, ask about how long is this going to take mm -hmm. i don't know forever time is not a factor here <laughs> it's a career decision that can be life-changing and there is there is no way to really estimate the time it's very personal everybody is different um, but you have to do the things that you have to do, which means sitting at a computer and doing nothing is not working on this project. And that, that's a hazard. Like people sit there and look at the charts and think that they are learning something. It's not. Learning is an active thing. You should get tired at, at the end of the hour. You, you can't sustain it more than two hours. If you are not getting tired after two hours, you're not really actively learning. So don't put any time, time on it. Don't restrain yourself financially because this is going to take a long time and it might be longer than you think. Um, and just try to do two or three very simple things. The, the simpler, the better. But do those two or three things very, very well. And that should be enough. Um, the, the correct way of thinking about trading is to think about it as a factory owner, okay, that manufactures a, a widget, whatever it is. You just need to manufacture one widget that sells to be successful. You don't need anything else. Which means in, in the con context of trading, if you look at any setup as a product that you're manufacturing, um, you just have to manufacture high quality products. But of one model, you don't need 10 models. So there is just one thing that you do, for example, the micro channels that we talked about today, that's enough, happens maybe three or four times a day. So you have three or four opportunities to trade that setup. Um, and then once that product is perfect and it is now producing some revenue, you can move on to <clears throat> engineer and build the next product, mm. which could be maybe a pullback. Okay. But basically you don't have to do much. The less you do, the better off you're, you're going to be, but you have to do it well and have a business mentality behind it, you know? I'm producing a set of products, and these are my products. This is the uh, manufacturing process for it, all the decision trees and things that we talked about. And I know that there's going to be some defects, and those are the losing trades. Hmm. So this might help remove some of those emotions, but don't put any time and financial restraints on it because it's going to um, probably burden you too much. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. My uh, pleasure. It was really inspiring. I love I loved uh, this conversation. Um so I really appreciate your time. Um My I'm, going to, I'm going to uh I'll email you once uh once we're done here. Um okay. and I'll let you know once it's up and everything, but I really appreciate your time. Thank you so much. My pleasure.